Hey there, what are we doing today? Well, today I am going over my October monthly budget. It's a little early to be doing it, but I always tend to forget and I never share it with you. And I, I'm usually a last minute Lucy, but not today. So let's get started. Our income has changed a bit. See, this is monthly, not paycheck. This is the monthly overview. So our, our income has changed a little bit, actually a lot of it, but hopefully that's temporary for now. It's just been a year of adjustments, that's for sure. But our income is 45.20. Okie doke. So these are mostly our fixed expenses. Um, some have changed, some haven't. But our taxes and insurance, we do not have a mortgage, but we do have to pay taxes and insurance on the house, so that is 360. Auto insurance, again, I don't pay every month, but I take it out every month and then pay every six months. I'm hoping I'm building up a cushion. I have State Farm and that little monitor thing that rides around in your car. I'm hoping we're saving money with that. I am a little speedy. I have to check myself and my husband is, he's kind of breaky. So I don't know, we'll see. Internet, now newsflash, my husband finally said we don't have to have cable anymore. I'm like, okay. So I took the cable box back yesterday. I don't know what this bill is gonna be. So I'm gonna put it in pencil at 120 just for internet and you know, Spectrum might say, oh, you already owe this and this and this, whatever. So we're going with 120 for now. I'm not exactly sure. The pool is 165. Uh, electricity, again, that's, we have a new bill coming out in the middle of October. So they reevaluate every three months, take your monthly total for three months, divide it by three, and then they work on your average billing plan. So I don't know. I'm going to put it at 265 because we would have been running, actually 260, running that AC because it's been hot. But that's that's just what you do in Florida. So that's in pencil too. Our phones are $60. They're $59.98, but you know, $60. And that is through Spectrum. Savings, this is an auto draw at Bank of America. It's $25. Natural gas is $20. Sometimes it's less, sometimes it's more, but I always send in 20. So far it's worked out. Uh, H2O, our water bill is 20. I send in 20. Sometimes it's less, sometimes it's more. Now we have, I have had Netflix for probably six months or so. So I've included that and we, we signed up for Peacock. You know, we're trying to find the best streaming channels for the shows that he watches and I watch. It's been interesting and Peacock, I think, and I'm not sure. This might be 20. I don't know. I think it's less. But let's leave it at 20 for now because actually I think we have Discovery Plus and I have to see how much that is. But I'm not going to put it on here yet. I'll put it on here when I have to reevaluate. See? Putting my head in the sand. I have to pay or we have to pay our health insurance and that will be, that's through my husband's work, which which is okay. And that is 550 that has caused um, a little bit of a fluctuation in our budget. That's for this. You, I think we could operate on four thousand. Typically, um, if we and we are cutting corners more or less. There are some things we could still cut out, but we're not going to do that. So, right now, that's our monthly operating expenses. Now, when he goes back to work, it will probably be the same, but I'll still I'll have that extra five fifty left over to use for more savings challenges or to tuck that money away or investing because I still invest even though I am retired. I like it. Okay, groceries. We're going to put this at 800 and hope that we do it. I've tried tracking groceries last this month. It, it's not gone well. So we're just going to kind of erase it, start over for October. I'm going to do that a lot. Gas is going to be 275. He fills up twice a month. It's about $75. I fill up twice a month. So that's 150. And then I, I, I probably spend 45 or 50 to 50. So that's fair right there. Eating out, uh, we eat out once a week and we treat ourselves and it's not cheap. Eating out even at a fast food place is not cheap. It, we call it Arthur Treachers because we can get fish and chips. Uh, some weekends we bring it home to save a few dollars or we have things to do. And some weekends we sit there and drink a couple beers and enjoy ourselves. So there's that. Um, pets, this is for Maggie. That's about $40. I'm pretty good on cat food. I've stocked up on some BOGOs, but this is for her kitty litter. And welding, this is going to be cash. 
for my husband that's his hobby so he saves up for big pieces of metal or whatever he wants so that's going to be cash let me write that there i have to pull that out and his walking around money or his week monthly cash allotment we both get the same i keep mine in the bank and sometimes i use my debit card or my credit credit card with rewards and buy stuff for me or not so that stays in the bank and my hobby is the crows and disney and i give myself 40 dollars a month for that tolls it could have been up here it used to be up here but now it's down here because we're not spending like we used to on tolls because my husband's not driving to and from his work so that is uh, tolls is around 50 dollars and that's that's pretty accurate oh oh my god we're slacking off here i forgot to add up <laughs> All right, let's add up this real quick, okay? Ready, honey? Here we go. Okay. That is one, two, four, four. I'm gonna put that to the side right here. Oh no, I'm not gonna put it there because I have to put the actual there. One, two, four, four. Plus th that five fifty. It's $17.94. Oh. We're going to try that one more time. Oops. My numbers are going to be off, but that's no surprise. So that's $17.94 total. I had it at 17.74. I don't know. All right, so let's look at this. I'm going to have to lose 20. I'm going to be over. I'm going to be over budget. 800, 275 plus 300 plus 40 plus 60 plus 80 plus 80. 17.25. That's fine. That seems like a lot, but I'm telling you, groceries are no joke. Those flat of eggs I usually get at Target that I would probably pay five or six dollars for, they're up to $8.99. You get 30 for $8.99, I mean, honestly. You all know the struggle. I'm not telling you nothing you don't know. All right, so these are the sinking funds, our purpose funds. We put money aside for things that happen or we know are coming, and it's very helpful. I love my little sinking purpose funds. Okay, so auto, we've had to cut that back to 85. Home is 85. And medical, we're keeping that at 170. Annual subs is 150. I have a whole list of annual subscription and memberships that I have to keep track of and make sure they get paid. And so far, it's been working out pretty good. Uh, beauty is 120. That's for haircuts and highlights because, you know, vanity lives on. Travel, 20. This, you know, these I don't always have to have money for, but I try. Uh, clothes is 50. Birthdays is 40. I have one more birthday this season, this year. It's my daughter's. She's turning 40. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. Electronics, 20. Uh, miscellaneous rando 30 again I don't need to put all that in there but it's there just in case or I can take it out so there's that let's check this baby out 770 okie dokie all right and these annual subs some beauty these are cash right here I have to mark it or I will I doodle doodle all over everything. I mean, it's just kind of like my brain on fire. All right, so I do have, I don't have any debt. Um, I have some savings challenges that I'd like to fund. Show me the love. That gets about 100 a month. And that's enough. And my holiday binder, which used to get 100 a month, is now getting 50. But we're going to make do. And some savings challenges. I'm going to put $100 aside for that. That's you know, if we have it, we'll do it. And that's that. So let's add this baby up. 100 plus 50 plus 100. It's 250. 
Okay, 250. We'll add all of these up. And we have 17.94 plus 17.25 plus 7.70 plus 250. 45.39. That's our total. Is what is it? 45.39. Uh, just gonna write that there. Minus forty-five twenty, which is nineteen dollars. I'm gonna be short nineteen dollars. You know, that's when I'll have to just kind of actually pay what is owed on natural gas. Maybe nothing, because I always pay ahead. Or I'll just finagle it right there. We're just winging it, is what we're doing. Same old, same old. Okay, you guys, thanks so much for hanging out with me today. Um, this sheet is from The Binder, The Budget Mom. I bought the whole book, but the whole book is kind of overwhelming to me, so I make copies of the pages. So, yeah. And I like this format. So far, it's working. And that's it. All right. If you got this far in this video, let me know in the comments by leaving a rocket emoji or a little spaceship. Okay, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me, and I hope you have a great rest of your week, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.